All right, folks, this video, we're going to go over the ASRock Z690 Pro motherboard as fast as we can, all right? So um, if you want to see a little more detail, let me take my time and show you all the other stuff in the box. Check out for the link down below. All right. So here we go, folks. 12th gen. This will eventually support 13th gen. Uh, guess what? I can't take it out of there. There's where CPU goes. You can see LGA 1700, 1800. Four slots for DDR4 RAM. Okay, this one does not support DDR5. 24 pin power. All right. Here is a uh, case fan. I believe there's five total um, of those. Two CPU connectors up here. All right. USB 3.0. O coming from your case, USB Type C from your case, another USB 3.0, six SATAs here, two more SATAs there. You've got right here your case connectors, okay? Two USBs, another case fan. Not really sure what that guy is right there, folks. Hopefully you can get a look at it. Should have an ARGB right there. Here's your HD audio. CMOS battery. Now, uh, we have three slots for M.2s. This is a Hyper, and this one's a Hyper M.2 here. Ultra M.2 here. Wi-Fi, all right. You can see it doesn't have the little thing for the Wi-Fi antennas. I think I said CMOS battery. This is up to PCIe 5.0, 4.0, 3.0, and two of the uh, one-inch ones. Another case fan here. This has uh, got, you know, overclocking capability, not extreme, where it would have two of the 1x8s, but 1x8 and 1x4. Got heat sinks. What have we missed, folks? Uh, more ARGB over here. And let's check this out, okay? Line out, line out, headphone, microphone, 2.5 LAN, 4 USB 3.0s. Here's a uh, reset for the BIOS or a BIOS update button. Okay. HDMI, Display Port, and USB 2.0 PS2. Okay. This does uh, require the I/O shield, or doesn't require it, but comes with an I/O shield. And that's about it, folks. Thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.